pink and it's so gorgeous. I really like it. So it's in here in the new tropical. Right there it's 320. That is not bad for how big that is. Seriously good. And this floating balloon right here, hmm, I have just enough to get it. I really think that I should. So, where did it go? Where is it? Oh, it's in the wall up there. Okay, is it supposed to be up there? I don't think so. Here's my beautiful lion, if you guys like that. As I think I said before, I got that off a of sniper kitty. She has on her page how to do that. And in the front, I just put the decorative pot, which I added. And then in the back, I did a torch light for the tail, and it's really cool. Um, this is the floating balloon. It looks like you can change the color, so I probably need to do pink to go with my new tree. Duh. Why is it not changing? Pink, I said. Pink. Maybe if I wiggle my nose. Digga, digga. There we go. And then it says to push. Yes, that is my child. Sorry. It says to push the button to activate. There it goes. Okay. So, I think I'm going to try to float on it. Of course, isn't that the natural thing to try to do? It doesn't have a button where you can try to sit on it. Please excuse my child like that is all day long, really. Sorry. Hmm. I'm going to come over here and wait. I hope it comes this way so I can jump on it. It's so cool that that can just be floating around your house all the time. I really love it. I'm not even joking. It's going all the way up there though. Like I really can't reach it unless I get on my glider or something. Look at that. That's cool. Digging the thing, digging on you, digging on me. Okay, this is like my chance. Here we go. Okay, I am on. It's on like Donkey Kong now. Oh, okay, twirl. It's like the exact height of me. So, it's like my new hat. What do you guys think? You like it? I think it's cool. I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna fall. No, I'm falling. No. That's fun though. I like it. I love it. I wonder if you can have like more than one floating around. I didn't even think about that, but that would be cool. Just have like a house full of floating balloons. Hmm. You know, my house is so packed with stuff. I think that it would just fit right in perfectly with my theme. I'm a hoarder of all good things. Well, it's far away now, so I'm just gonna have to fly on up here and that's not gonna work because I'm going way too fast. <laughs> Okay, let's see. I have these boards on the top everywhere just because I use them when I'm doing my edits. And so I just kind of push them to the top because I know I'm probably going to use them again. So it's no sense to delete them and then buy them again. I just put them up there all the time. But that didn't work out very well. So let's see what... Where did it go? Did it come in here? Did it go up there? Maybe I have a better chance from the diving board? I don't know. What should I do? I excuse the decoration, which is not on this room. I don't come up here often. The other rooms up here are decorated, but this one... I just kind of think of it like a pool 
changing room or something. Oh my gosh, that did not just happen. That is forever putting my head in the wall. Ouch. Well, I have to say that I like it. I'm kind of fascinated right now by the whole thing. I didn't expect that, honestly. I didn't, I saw floating balloon, but I wasn't thinking that's, that it was like for real floating around. So I'm gonna put it here, and then, oh, no, it's not working out very well for me to be on it though. I don't think it likes me very much. It really doesn't, it's trying to get away from me. It's like, go away, girl. It does not want me to be there. I keep going. I think if you stand right there on that little brown square and then push the button, activate. Oh, I'm gonna sit down and see. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I'm falling again. Excuse over there, I do have barriers and stuff going on. I think I'm gonna change that whole thing. I'm not even feeling it. I saw in another friend's house, she used those shelves for stairs and I really like how they look because you can color all the way up. I think I'm just gonna alternate like those and the stairs and alternate trying to make it work better because I'm not feeling how this is looking. Yeah, so I, I have the cannon too, which I did make a video of that before. If you didn't see it, go check it out. So, when I was watching on Sniper Kitty's YouTube channel, she had, for each of her pets, like a little area that she made. And she did something kind of like this uh, for the boar, or for something like that. Anyways, it was kind of like a mud bath that gave me the idea to come and create my own. I have no idea how she did it. I know she said it took her a really long time. And so, it really did take me a really long time too. It's not easy, but I love it. I think it's really cool for the wild boars. I just call them pigs. <laughs> I think it's cool for the pigs to come and take a mud bath, but people put whatever pet they feel like putting in there and also themselves. And it's fun. It just looks, it just adds character to the area, especially since I have this huge outside area over here. So I just kind of built around it and put whatever just to make it work. And I love it. And I get a lot of compliments on it. I think it's fun. I mean, it's brown. Obviously, it's not pretty, but it's cool. So, getting a lot of offers right now, which is normal. It's like every, all the time. I, this is actually one of the, I think it's the futuristic hot tub that I put down in here. And then I built around it um, with different things. I used lockers and colored them brown. I used those wooden barrels. I, um, I was going to use the barriers, but they went inside and you couldn't go in all the way inside. You could actually take a bath, but then if you were standing on it, it didn't put your whole body in there. And I didn't like that, so I took them out. And that's it. I think that's going to be all for today. Um, if you have any ideas of anything that you would like for me to try to do, just put them in the comments. I do read my YouTube comments all the time. Uh, I'm open to any suggestions. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Yes, that's still my kid. Bye, peace.